anytime you open your mouth to speak mm. you say things that are contrary to the norms like you just said and you get a lot of heat for that most definitely social media being one of the platforms where people are definitely expressive mm. knowing that they can hide behind some mm. a different identity and all that the type of heat that you get mm. has it transformed from social media to personal i have never met anybody who has said i don't like you before mm. i've been on social media since 1998 i've not met one person mm. so, so i ask that those who insult on social media is that they don't have law refer to come to town or what mm. because i don't meet them okay and the issue is that allow people to say what they want, want to, to say. say like i came here i had to wait Mm -hmm. for your show that's the time I, I go on my phone and see if i can have engage somebody if you, somebody has insulted me to go and reply we will do back and forth and then so me i will leave and go it, it's entertaining okay don't get angry these are words and the people some of them they don't even mean it okay. look on social media today somebody is insulted because you are talking about uh, mpp tomorrow you are you are you are talking about uh, asna the same people they are support the people they are confused <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't take this and it will never change me okay it will never change mm. anything about Kwame Plus. Kwame Plus. Look, the day they mentioned my name in this country, 1998, when they mentioned my name, Kwame A Plus, they, they have never stopped and they can't stop. Mm. They cannot stop. Oh. I mean, when I see that they have stopped, I'll find a way to get, to get the whole country to talk about me. <laughs> they will talk hard to. One day, they'll talk about. Now they are talking about, hey, he wants to become MP. Instead mm. of you two trying to be MP, you are wasting your time thinking about what I want to be. No problem. I will be too. Mm -hmm. And when I be the MP, they'll start talking about whether I'm a good MP or, or I'm a bad, bad MP. Then I'll tell them I want to be president. Then they'll start talking about why I, I, I can't be president. Then I will be too. <laughs> Let them talk. So, so you have plans of becoming the president? I have plans of becoming Jesus. If God says, who should I send? Who should I will raise up my hand. If he picks me, fine. Fantastic. Has these threats on social media, have you gotten some personal? No. Every, most of the people who are... Who, who, can people don't pick up a phone to call you anonymously to threaten mm. you say hey if you are someone okay uh, maybe like, okay i've had one or two but i gave them my house address so um, yeah we're ready yeah bro you see say you want you to sleep mm -hmm. you hold your phone eh? and yeah. you go play with your phone uh, mm -hmm. then maybe you go on social yeah, media then you go I sleep i mean when i did sleep i did hold my gun okay. i did play with gun. i go wake up my hand in my gun talk i mean i don't be finical you can't come you you can't do yeah, it's like like maybe today I'm here. Mm -hmm. Me sometimes I'm sitting on UTV. I have a gun in my pants. Hey, the day the people came to UTV, I was not there. We will be telling us different story. Me, me like me, I'm just living, and I don't want like Fennec was in his room, mm. sleeping, mm. and then people came and he had to wait for them to come and murder him. Bro, you can't die like that. Mm. He had to wait. He yeah. didn't have nothing, so he had no to, form of protection. No form of protection. So he just had to wait for them to break in. Mm. Cut his fence, jump over, break his door, and come and murder him. I have the pictures here. I was one of the first people in the house, and I didn't release the pictures to the media because I couldn't see my guy out there like that. So when mm -hmm. I got there, I took the pictures before the police. I still have the pictures on my phone. Wow. And when I look at Phoenix's picture, I say to myself, "Me, I will not." You are not going down like that, bro. When you I, the kind of things I will do before I die, eh? when you put me on that my bed you mm -hmm. see me smiling like 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 me smiley because like me shoot to be on some issue me we're live on facebook here to answer one <laughs> <laughs> 3.9 fm <laughs> if you die still at me smiley say me 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 finish it one back home, back home. Back home. Uh -huh. yeah mm -hmm. nobody nobody people like your mom is home sleeping oh papa da they see you on TV. I'm going to attack somebody because of his opinion. But mm -hmm. you to have your opinion. Mm -hmm. Let me say something on your show today. Uh, anybody who was not happy with my uh, uh, my outbursts, mm -hmm. or the recent one, the recent one with Socrates Safo, yeah, or how I handled that situation, I. If anybody was not happy with it, the fact that you made somebody mm -hmm. unhappy is, to me, is it, though it's not it, it's not right. Mm -hmm. And I will apologize to everybody who didn't like what happened mm -hmm. because I know that there are a lot of people who like me. Mm -hmm. So if somebody didn't like it, then I apologize that, that I made them feel that way. Yeah. However, it was the right thing to do. Why? 
it was the right thing to do because we are sitting on it on this show. Yeah. And we go there to speak our minds. It's my opinion. Mm -hmm. Whether I like Akufuado or not, it's not your problem. You to like Akufuado. Mm -hmm. Then some people come to attack us on the show. And you are somebody who come, you come on the show. Yes. And it is alleged that you said you were happy that the people came and they had to come and beat me. They, to, they are happy that the people came on the show. Mm -hmm. And let's say it is, it is not true that he said it, but did you condemn it? Because you are the MPP person who comes on the show. Yes. And you didn't condemn it. Then you come back on that same show that you wanted people to come and beat me. To come and talk about uh, you come and talk against if you think that we don't that is not a, pl a platform mm -hmm. for us to air our views and you think that just speaking against your government deserves what happened what type of the type what of are you coming to do there you two are coming to talk against ndc mm -hmm. we are talking against mpp and you think that people should beat us and you are coming to use the same plat platform to talk, mm -hmm. and then don't come mm -hmm. So before I came on TV, I was said that I have cool. And we were planning what we would do on the show. So it's not that. It just <laughs> happened. Oh. It was premeditated. Oh, and then my. I told them that. I told them I have cool that. I can't tell the, the producer not to bring Socrate on the show. Mm -hmm. But he will leave. And he said, I can't tell you to come. <laughs> that they shouldn't bring you. But I'll make sure that <laughs> you leave. You will be coffee. So when he was leaving, mm -hmm. that was like I had achieved my yeah, aim. Accomplished. Mission accomplished. Oko cross and Jane five hundred now, so Oko. Would you know how mom the brain? You know, if you be me, we are bored. We are to go. I don't take any money. So the he bought by no ball. Okay, is it or relax? Say boy, you know. It's a just coming on some ball, you know. But you, I want to ask you this question. This, this is, this is personal. Yeah. You've, you've been a, a very vocal person, right? And being outspoken almost always in this part of the world comes with its own <laughs> backlash. Yeah. Don't you get scared at some point? Um, the people, people were made different. Yeah, my mom, when my mom starts talking, I, I jokingly say, Yes, also, or Baba, my Still, when we do my but more you know, we are here for for different purposes. Okay, uh, and I I believe that I came here for a different purpose. Mm. Yeah, bro. What do you think the purpose is? The purpose is to do exactly what I'm doing, and I and the reason why I don't get scared is that you positively die. One day you die. Mm. I spoke with my father on Wednesday. I told him on. And Friday, Thursday morning, he was dead. Even when I was speaking with him, he said, He was not sick. Friday morning, he was gone. Wow. So, my outlook on life is different. Mm -hmm. I, I have to do everything now. If I don't die today, I'll die tomorrow. If I don't die tomorrow, I'll die next year. If yeah. I, you will positively die. So, my whole life is, has nothing to do with being scared. Mm -hmm. I'm not fearless, but fear can never stop me from doing what I think I'm here for. Okay. So, what is that one thing that you're afraid of? To give people the impression that uh, I think I'm better than them. Mm. The impression, just that impression. I'm. I just want to. <laughs> I'm <well -worn> <laughs> <laughs> I I I just want to. I just want to live. Mm. Um, to be as nice as possible to everybody, but to also be very strong. Yeah. and uh, to to prevent you from thinking that you have an advantage over me okay so it makes it very complicated mm. but what my my biggest fear I, I i want people to see me and uh be able to treat me i i hate it when mm -hmm. people meet me in town and they don't call me and they come on facebook and say i was the one sitting next to you at the restaurant i, I say for us and free work oh, oh, friend. Friend. You, you understand okay yeah i i just want to live Mm. everybody must be happy what what is that big misconception about outspoken people yeah what is that misconception about the difference the difference between uh, confidence and, and arrogance. arrogance that's the, that's that's the people problem. people can strike that yes my kids mm -hmm. my kids when you meet them and you have a conversation with them 
if you if you don't understand them, then it becomes difficult. Because I, I was with my my daughter uh, just about five days ago, mm. and we met this big man, a minister, and and he said, "When are you going back to the UK?" And he said, "I don't know." And then minister said, "But why don't you know?" He said, "How am I supposed to know? Ask mommy." You want to tell me I'm just here, I'm just following my mother. <laughs> <laughs> it, it might come off as offensive yeah, a little offensive, bit. Of, yeah. Yeah. How am I supposed to know? Ask wow. mommy because mommy is standing here and you're asking me when I'm going. So you ask, you understand. You are not asking the right question. You are not asking the right question. And that's and, reason. <laughs> and uh, when, it is because of how we, how we, we grew up. Mm. Uh, we, are, we, are, we are made to be timid. Every Ghanaian kid grows up. Most Ghanaian kids grow up timid. Mm -hmm. uh, there is not a single Ghanaian footballer who could do what Suarez did to us. Because growing up, you have been told that So even if you are going to lose, mm -hmm. if they are going to they are going to score, mm -hmm. you, and you have to die for your country, take that red card. Mm -hmm. No Ghanaian kid. They have programmed you in such a way. Yes. Don't do that. Don't think outside that the box. Yeah, Mary gave birth to Jesus. Don't ask question mm -hmm. as to how. Where the, no, no, no. Don't ask. Adam, Eve gave apple. Snake spoke to the man, and the and the man gave a woman, and the woman ate <laughs> apple and gave her to them. Don't ask. That is how we are made. So immediately you start asking, how did a snake and a woman have a conversation? Ah, we <laughs> exactly. Mm. And so it makes it difficult for you to ask questions. It makes it, it makes it difficult for you to uh, uh, to be opinionated. It makes mm -hmm. it difficult for you to 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 be to dare to be different. Okay. And then you come out as arrogant. Hey, wait there. If DJ Slim is the one mm -hmm. who can play music, who does the show mm -hmm. that and and people love DJ Slim for what he does, mm -hmm. even though you are playing music and they are dancing mm -hmm. and they are enjoying the show. The next moment, okay, I saw born your mama. But you are enjoying it. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't add up. <laughs> you know. <laughs> you know. It, so, so it's in our upbringing. It's in our upbringing. Oh my, make casa penny casa man can be. So penny didn't quite see some cry. You didn't eat it. The most. You see Jesus Christ, eh? Mm -hmm. Then you be guy man fucking. Tell me about it. See Jesus Christ, eh? Mm -hmm. He said, there are plenty mansions in my father's house. Mm -hmm. Shatter always said, they the were chained. He said, hey, he mm -hmm. the brag. <laughs> he says, the brag past Shatter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Jesus watched. Jesus was like 20 something. Mm -hmm. And you look at the Pharisees. Mm -hmm. Go and read it in the Bible. Yes. So Pharisee for one kwasia for. Mm -hmm. And these were men in their 70s yes. and 80s. Well, 20 something years And this 20, you, you understand. Mm. So you want to be Christ-like. Sometimes you have to go to the temple and beat the people. Mm. Sometimes you have to go to the temple and beat the people. Mm. Do you think Christianity hasn't been fair or religion hasn't been fair to us with respect to our upbringing and our state of mind? Uh, I think that it has its good sides and the bad side. And the, bad side. What's the good side I, the good side is that uh, a lot of people have benefited from religion mm -hmm. there was a, there was genocide in rwanda mm -hmm. 800,000 people are estimated to have died in 2 weeks mm -hmm. it took the catholic church the, what there was no hope and people in this whole life depends on hope there was no hope that was the time the church had to step in. Religion had to step in and, and promise the people a certain hope to get the people to get up and start moving again. Mm -hmm. Religion has done a lot. Mm -hmm. But on the other side, it has also programmed us in a certain way. Mm -hmm. So you cannot say religion has been all that bad or it has been all that good. It has made us, you have to grow up. I grew up a Jehovah's Witness. Okay. Oh, JW. Yeah. Mm. My father, my mother, my grandmother, my most of my aunties and uncles. Wow. So, so me, my house is JW. And my father built the church. My, you wow. understand, my father was a wow. secute overseer. Wow. 
but I grew up different. Mm. I grew up a different human being. When I was growing up, I was just watching them and I was asking myself, how did a snake give an apple to a woman? That was the first question. Yeah. <laughs> and when I grew up, I keep Snaking telling... Snaking in some way. It's like, <laughs> it's like that whole creation story. Mm -hmm. I had to ask questions. Mm. Who did you ask? All the people I asked were people who were told that just believe. Mm -hmm. Don't ask questions. Religion is faith. Yes. Mm. And so when I grew up, I, because of my belief in Kwame Nkrumah, I started thinking different. Okay. Kwame Nkrumah, did anybody, uh, our parents would tell you Kwame Nkrumah was, uh, worshipped something called Kankai Nyame. Kankai Nyame, yeah. I've heard about that. Kwame Nkrumah sum Kankai Nyame. Mm -hmm. Kwame Nkrumah said, Mumma yang ko sum en kani kani nyame na ye nim no no. Okay. Because when the, when, when, when the missionaries came here, mm -hmm. they told you that, they have one guy in the sky. Mm -hmm. His name is God. And we told them that we also have that same guy here. Mm -hmm. His name is Nyanko Pong. Mm -hmm. When they came here, they said that guy has some, some uh, children or servants and they are called angels. And we said, we also have them here. Mm -hmm. You call them angels. We call them Bosom. Mm -hmm. So you have Michael and Gabriel. Mm -hmm. And we have Nogopo and we have Antoine and we have all of them. Tigare. Yeah, you worship your God by burning incense. Mm -hmm. The Catholics burn incense. Mm -hmm. And then they pray. Yeah. And then they say, when you burn the incense and you pray, it expedites your prayer and mm -hmm. it goes to God. Mm -hmm. We also pour libation. Yes. They say they have somebody called Samson in their book. Mm -hmm. We also say we have somebody called Asibu Amenfi. Mm -hmm. They have Shadrach, Meshach, Abednego. Mm -hmm. We also have Obruman, Kuma, Osun, mm -hmm. and Odapeja. Yeah. So, and you said, ours is not true. Yours, Yours is true. true. So I just don't get it. <laughs> we should forget our own so and on, subscribe to and yours. subscribe to yours. When we pour libation, you say we are going to hell. But when you burn incense, you are you, going to heaven. Mm. If white man knows where you pass, uh, where you go and walk on gold, mm -hmm. there is no way the white man will come here and black man. They mm -hmm. translated the Bible into every language for you to be programmed in a certain way. But they didn't tell you how to repair the drill that they use on the on the on the on the uh, uh, sea mm -hmm. high seas to drill. So when in Ghana here, all that uh, uh, petroleum commission does is to is purchasing orders. They just have to to order. And when your drill, when the bit is is, is is damaged, you have to take it back to them so that they take money from you and repair it. But as for Bible, they, they put it in your language so you understand. So you see, religion has done good. Is hospital schools, the hospital Kromujiska. You go hospital, you go, you pay. <laughs> missionary schools, you pay. It's missionary schools, you, you still pay. Yeah. And uh, you, you can't write it off entirely. However, people must start thinking differently. Mm -hmm. Don't you think that would affect the basis of any form of religion if there's questioning? Yes. Because they, the, the belief mm. is the, the whole concept of religion is the bedrock should be faith or is faith. And it's supposed to be a, a, a more religious or a spiritual process. If, if, if without people who think differently, this world won't be where it is today. Okay. You have to dare to be different. Mm -hmm. So everybody, we started with a gram. Is it the gramophone? Yeah. Maybe we started with drums and mm -hmm. whatever. Before music storage. Before music storage. Yeah. The vinyl and the. And it went on and on. It came to CD, mm -hmm. it came to pen drive, it came to all these storage devices. Now we are, we are, we, we, uh, now it's cloud storage. Yes. People must think different. The, mm -hmm. the, the, everybody, everybody, somebody invented the iron mm -hmm. and was making so much money from ironing. People must buy iron to iron your shirt. One day, one guy woke up and said, uh, that shirt, the, the, um, the wrinkled one. Wrinkled one. Yeah. It's going to be the order of the it's day. It's going to be the order of the day. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> My last killer is fooling in the other. This guy. Yeah. This guy has been using me to play shows. Yeah. Yeah, yeah he can go. Hey, this might look alike. I, I, I tell them you are my younger brother. <laughs> you know, so people must think differently. Yeah. It's allowed. It should and, be allowed. And people must question religion. Mm. 
if people are not asking questions, this world will never move mm -hmm. from where it is. You need people who think like Elon Musk. Mm -hmm. That's why he, that's why Elon Musk has twelve children and no no wife because his DNA is smart. So he has to born plenty. So people will think smart. Most why, smart why why must everybody get married? Mm. It has become the norm. You are born, go to school, mm -hmm. get a job, job. Marry. get married have children you are going to in, into an institution where the signs are like like you are driving they say where you are going, you are going to enter ceo then you are gas you are you are stepping on the gas every saturday they're going to marry every monday they are divorcing the issues why can't one woman say i just want to have a child i don't want to have a husband somebody must also think like that mm -hmm. people must be allowed to think to think freely but religion makes you, it, it, it stops you from thinking. Mm. Religion will stop you. For instance, before my father died, I was in a car with him. We were driving to the hospital. And I asked him, my father, everybody calls him Dan. I said, Dan, this Joseph story, Joseph, you see Joseph, says, hey, are you Hey, you I you I said, Joseph story. I said, are you said, Joseph, and I you so after he said everything, mm -hmm. as now time now you saw no. What can Joseph asama? What can call paradise? No, you witness people. They are going mm -hmm. to paradise. paradise yeah. So what can call paradise? Paradise. But me, when I was listening to Joseph's story, I was listening to what is happening now. Mm -hmm. All your children, everybody listen to you. Yeah. And so they are they are successful. Yeah. But the most successful child that you have. Used to be an assistant headmistress in Kumasi Girls. Mm -hmm. It's now headmistress in one of these Kumasi. So that's my big sister. Yeah. But that is not the kind of success I'm looking for. Mm -hmm. I want to be more successful than despite and for example. Mm -hmm. So now that you are old, and we go to the hospital, and UGMC takes us like four thousand per visit to mm -hmm. the hospital. Mm -hmm. How many of your kids will be able will to be able to afford that? Mm -hmm. So I am your Joseph, mm -hmm. that you are talking about. Growing up, I knew that what you were giving us is not won't be sustainable, mm -hmm. and that is that's the day I saw my father cry. Mm. Yes, people must think differently. People must think differently. People must dare to be different. Normal doesn't work. Normal sucks. Mm. Normal has never worked. Normal will never work.